on February 1st, 1992, and National Association of the Disciples of Angola was created in Angola, Africa. At the time, still living under the horrors of the post-independence civil war, and began a strenuous struggle and a dedication on behalf of people with disabilities in Angola. According to United Nations figures, currently reaching 656,000 people with disabilities. Many conferences, assembly and various actions were carried out through the country during Anne's 27 years of existence, which ensured its continuity. However, much remains to be done. The existence of a large number of landmines in a large part of Angola territory, in addition to impairing the development of the agriculture, today represents a great challenge to be overcome, so that the number of people with disabilities does not increase even further. Another challenge to be overcome is the increasing number of road fatalities that annually are forming a new arm of people with disabilities. The bad condition of the road network and the recklessness of a countless driver are the main responsibility for the formation of this army of the people with disabilities. We need to change this picture and Anne is fully aware of the role it plays and has been doing throughout its existence seeks to update itself and seeks new technology that allow it to keep up with developments around the world. Important voices of the community of the people with disability throughout Angola. In addition to encouraging the small entrepreneurs, Anne has been an important role to play in improving accessibility throughout the country and raising awareness of the employability of people with disabilities. Starting with the architectural pillar, how do builders, architects and entrepreneurs think when build school, hospital, it seems that there are no people with disabilities in Angola. They cannot afford accessibility for people with disabilities. They cannot put right bathrooms for people with disability. They cannot fit doors for disabled persons. If we pay attention to the information from the United Nations, 7.5 billion people on the planet, 800 million are people with disabilities. Peck and Agreements Program. Through this program, and creates a financial fund that will enable it to obtain a great resource for the purchases of a wheelchair, crutches, prothesis, and another needs of people with disabilities. Have you thought about giving wings to anyone who wants to fly? Or are legs for those who cannot walk? From now on, we you have that power, deposit monthly to our account 500 or 1000 or 2000 and guarantee a special discount on health, commerce, education, products and service in general. So, ends need you. Health and training program. The training of people with disabilities is the first and decisive step towards employability. The more educated and prepared, the greater the chances of a people with disabilities 
in a competitive and still small Angolan labor market, but with a lot of potential for growth. Kai and Employment Program already in operation in and digital platform. Website www.andangola.org through the buy and the jobs database companies can register their jobs vacancies for people with disabilities while people with disabilities from all over Angola can register their respective curriculums. With Pi and Pi, it will be easier to comply with the presidential decree number 12 to 16 January that regulates the hiring of people with disabilities in Angola. Agrowanda and the agriculture's program also plays a key role in improving the quality of the life of the people with disabilities residing in rural areas. Good morning, everyone. We are here to prepare a condition that will allow us to celebrate the 27 years of the existence of the National Association of Disabled People of Angola. We came in this agriculture area to show what we are doing since foundation the association. One of the most important projects that we create within ANDA is the agriculture project. In addition to be here in Bengus province, more precisely in Kisumera area, we have other agriculture areas such as Bie, Mushiku, Wila, Wambu, Wish, where we are much more engaged in the cultivation of the maize, cassava, Soy beans, beans, vegetables, we have a lot of calf and potato too. All of this we are carrying out to enhance our organization. The logistic itself that will come out from the cultivation area will be for the benefit of the disabled people. Who are the wheelchair walking in woods like this? Those who have protests cultivate and prepare and help others who are unable to reach the harvest, like blind and other handicaps. Like those who are in a shoe store or in a store or in a classroom will benefit. And that Tangolan society recognize the people with disabilities are useful as a whole. At Andes Digital Platform, people with disability from all over Angola can register as associates and obtain a support. Also, at agreed companies that are fundamental in the pack. And the agreements program can register their discount for the Andes member. The disability products and services agents formed within the Under by a group of motivating young people has been a table for a joint and a focus work and through the social network and a weekly meetings managed to communicate with all the Indolent public in the broad. Come and be a part of the Under family. Under needs you.